Hi, Will. Hey, Joey. Nice How are you, sir? You. Come on in. Oh, thanks, buddy. This is a beautiful entryway. Thank you. What type of work do you do? We photograph about 100 weddings a year, about 1,200 portraits a year, mainly children, uh, family, um, and some commercial work also. These prints are gorgeous. Do you print here or use a lab? We actually print everything in-house. Wow. So we're totally in-house. Well, are you going to show us that today, too? We sure will. Terrific. So let's see what we got in the back of the studio here. What's in here? This is our, uh, one of our sales area. We have a LCD TV there. Uh, we also do the wedding inquiries in here. So we'll actually show some of the work um, of the photographers that actually are going to do the wedding on that, on that TV. Very nice. Well lit inside here, too. This is your projection area? This is our projection area. This is where we will project for wedding inquiries. Uh, we will project our work. We also will show a um, DVD of uh, our children, our three-month session here at the, in the theater. It's beautiful. A projector in the ceiling, mm -hmm. and then a drop-down screen whenever you need it. Correct. Looks like you've got a beautiful audio system, so you must put music to slideshows, make them really enticing. Absolutely. Very nice. When we do uh, framing here at the studio, in these drawers here, we actually have all our frame corners. Oh, what a great idea. Instead of keeping them on the on wall, wall and look like a frame shop, what we do is we actually have all these frames, all and the different types of frames in our frame shop. And frame sample books. wedding books? Sample wedding albums, yes. Beautiful. Beautiful. Great space. This looks like your office across the hallway. It is. Mm -hmm. My office also doubles up as a sales area and a, a workstation area. Um, so it's not just my office. You have to share your own office. I do. That's not it's, fair. Yeah, well, sometimes when you're the boss, you have to do that. That's the way it goes. Now, your PC here allows you to access anything you need to. You can pop into your server, your main storage. You can see photos. You're connected on a larger network here? Absolutely. So any of the computers here, I think there's 14 or 18 computers that are all hooked together. They're all tied into our server so we can access any of uh, file anywhere at any time. Are you all PC? Are you Mac and PC? We're mainly all PC. We okay. have one Mac uh, that we do some uploading to. That's some pretty impressive awards up on the wall, sir. Thanks, sir. But yes. All the awards in the world do not pay the rent. Yeah, isn't that the truth? <laughs> yeah. What's this area back here? This area here is, is where we had to expand the studio. We use angled walls for the studio, so then that way we would make the studio look like it's not so long and skinny. We moved our production area in the back upstairs, um, but we didn't want a long, skinny, narrow hallway. To we make also people feel restricted. Restricted, right, exactly. Opens it back didn't, up. didn't want to feel that tunnel effect. And when you get a chance to talk to mom, we got to keep the kids busy. What do we got here? We have a children's room. Our children's room it has an Xbox in it, it has video for the kids. If we have children that are scared, we'll put them in here, let them play for a little while. Or if I have a little kid that's rambunctious and wants to go run around everywhere, what we'll do is we'll use this as a reward. And we'll tell them, well, you get to go in the toy room after the session. And plus, you know, me being a dad and you having an Xbox, I would be in there. Yep. Yeah, we have a lot of dads that are in yeah. the... Yeah. Kid room. Uh, another sales area here? Correct. We have we put the sales area right near the kids' room, so then that way the kids could be in there, not bothering mom. Mom could be here, placing her order, and the salesperson has 100% of her attention rather than having the kids going, oh, I got to leave, I got to leave, I got to go. And what do you know, on display are some gorgeous kids' portraits, your baby panels, some things out of your kids' club. And just some drop-dead gorgeous frame choices for these prints. I mean, look at they're These are gorgeous. Thank you. Beautiful. Dressing room here off to the left. Oh, it looks like it's being occupied, so we better not pop in there. Huh? <laughs> the Master Control Center. This is my toy room. Studio number one, very large. It's about 30 by 30 wide. We have a lot of different sets. Uh, we want to be able to work very, very quickly in our studio. Our studio... Like I said, we photograph 1,200 portraits a year. They're set half an hour uh, apart. So every 30 minutes, we're actually changing sets, changing um, lighting for every session. Now, you've got a really smart setup here. You have basically permanent fill lights stashed in three different spots of the studio. Correct. 
then you'll move your main light wherever you need it and then just trigger whatever fill light you need to and you've got this down to almost the science. Absolutely. So if we're shooting towards the north, we've got our big families. If we shoot towards the east, you've got your specialty sets. If we shoot towards any other direction, we've got all kinds of different sets where you're just going to swing one main light around and use one of your built-in fill lights that you trigger wirelessly. Correct. This is brilliant. What about the second room back here? Looks like uh, an off-the-wall set? Correct, it's an off-the-wall set. Um, we actually built the upstairs because I bought the off-the-wall set and I had no place to put it. <laughs> so <laughs> I actually built the upstairs, which we were gonna do, but when I got the off-the-wall set and we paid for it, and I was going, okay, now what do we do? So now we actually built the second story a few years back. You know, you're in Los Angeles, I live in Chicago. My insurance man is climbing all over me about heavy-duty equipment gear because, of course, we've had all those leaf backs for so long. Mm -hmm. They made us keep them in a safe overnight when we were doing shoots and even when we had students in the place there. I noticed you have a secure camera room. Yep, no doorknob on this one. <laughs> so they need to get this way. So you keep cameras in here but in a safe. In a big, big rifle safe. And so they would have to get through our alarm system, through a bolt lock door, and then find out where the equipment is and then try to get through there and hopefully by then the police would be here. And it looks like they're all the same camera. High-end cannons? What are you shooting? Uh, we Mark II, Mark III's. We've got a few Mark I's. Uh, we also have Fuji, two Fuji S2's. I actually have a 200D also. So. Primarily, what do you shoot the bulk of your work on? Mark IIs. Mark IIs. Canon Mark IIs, absolutely. Canon lenses? All Canon lenses. Okay, I see Canon on camera flashes. Looks like some 580s and 580 version 2s. Correct. Keep all those in the safe, but when it comes to charging batteries, those kind of things, just leave them on the table. Leave Off them you on go. the table, yep. So you keep your cases for location shoots at the ready. Batteries on the charge. In the morning, you photographers can walk in. The photographers that work for you can right. walk in. Pop out a camera, put in a battery. I see you got a bunch of flashes for your beach work up there. This is extremely organized. Thank you. Very nice. Looks like you've got another high key set here for kids, maybe kids and families. What's this? This is mainly for children and for small family groupings. We have also high key on the other side, which is a 12 foot background that we'll do larger family groupings on if they want high key done. Uh, this we photograph here all day and night. So we just basically have to push one button, our lights go on, we're set and ready to rock and roll. High key is always a problem to photographers and we get so many questions on shootsmarter.com about high key. Let's come back and talk about lighting for high key because I know you're not a fix it in Photoshop kind of guy. You'd rather Absolutely. shoot it right? Right. Man after my own heart. 